Okay, so we're asked to draw a reciprocal graph, uh, so it's 1 over x plus 8. And I'm just going to go through um, each of the x uh, coordinates and find out what the y's are and then plot them on the graph. So I'm going to put, start with 5, um, so it's 1 fifth plus 8, which will be 8 and 1 fifth, so it will be just above the 8. Um, then uh, a quarter plus 8, so 8 and a quarter, that will be just slightly higher still. Uh, a third plus eight would be eight and a third, so slightly higher still. Um, half plus eight is eight and a half, which should be just here maybe. Uh, one plus eight is nine, which would be here. And then half, a uh, one over a half plus eight, which would be ten. And then as you get closer and closer to zero, so if I and put in 1 over a tenth plus 8, that would be 18, so we get quite high quite quickly there. Um, and so uh, looking at the other side, uh, minus 4, uh, so 1 over minus 4 plus 8, so that would be 8 take away a quarter, so it will be just under 8, and the same thing for this side. And it half would be um is it two uh minus two plus eight which would be six. So it'd be there. And then it would be uh about there. Okay. So what it will end up looking like, a reciprocal graph, it will look like this and this. Okay. But because we've had the plus eight, <clears throat> it will move up eight. So it will be in line with the 8 here, which it is. So we now need to join these up with one smooth curve, which is not easy on here. So make sure I go through all the points. And let's try with the other side. Probably easier to start at the bottom. No, nope, that was rubbish. Let's try again. Okay, that's not bad. That's probably as good as I can do on this machine. Um, the scales on this aren't perfect. Um, on the exam, I think you'll get a, a much nicer scale to be able to plot them, um, and it should be a, a lot easier.